Does getting on camera make you nervous? It made me nervous. And I actually had a lot of training in public speaking. My name is Dr. Lee Holcomb, and I'm a neuroscientist, and I'm the CEO of Career Catalyst Edge. So I was trained to be a public speaker. I taught classes at the university level. I worked for global companies where I got up on stage and talked with people. I ran conferences. And when I had to get on camera, it was a little bit intimidating for me. It's just a very different sort of experience talking into a camera when you don't see the reactions of other people. So I thought perhaps it would be time for me to get a great teacher because this was going to be my new normal. I had a career coaching business and we had a pandemic. So I couldn't do the face-to-face -face meeting with people. And like many people, we were looking for ways to be effective in our workplace because many of our meetings had gone to this virtual platform of talking on a camera, Zoom or some other sort of platform. So I happened to run across some great videos by Paul Gordon in The Art of Face Dancing, learning about being your authentic self, to be able to talk with other people through this medium of the camera. And I thought at first that, you know, I might just do it a little bit. And then I saw more and more people getting online and it becoming a viable business medium. Camera confidence and the ability to communicate with people like you would face to face is a key component now of our work and our career development. So I went from thinking, okay, it's a good idea to get on camera, it might help my coaching, to actually using it, I was working as a recruiter, to help people get jobs. Because no longer were people being able to go in and do the normal interview process. They were all of a sudden thrown into having to present themselves and their livelihood could depend on their ability to communicate through the camera. Finally, I actually did and on interview on camera myself to get from one position to another position. So what I've learned from Paul Gordon in The Art of Face Dancing about setting up my camera, uh, learning to speak more confidently on camera actually paid off because one of the questions that you are always asked in an interview are what are the things that you need to improve on? And for me, my area of improvement was the need to be confident on camera, to be able to express myself, to get around all the technology things that often hold us back. So uh, Paul set up a very simple rig for me, walked me through the steps of what did I need in order to be able to have the ability to create a video and to have a quality video. And it was not really expensive equipment. And so you too can benefit by working with Paul Gordon as your camera confidence coach, learning the performance mastery level skills that are important for your career and for your ability to communicate as a human being in this lockdown pandemic um, environment. So please, if you are interested in upping your skill level and gaining that mastery and just fluency of being able to communicate on camera, reach out to Paul Gordon, Art of Face Dancing. This is Dr. Lee Holcomb, just giving you my um, honest opinion of my experience with Paul Gordon. Thank you, and I enjoy connecting with you and hope that you'll have a blessed day.